Here he comes again. I wish he would let up. Matthew is practically stalking me. Hello Linda. How are you today? I am fine. I am in a bit of a hurry. So... I won't keep you. I just had a simple question. Okay. I'll bite. What is your question? Do you realize that, as an atheist, if you are correct, and no God exists, you will simply die, but if you are wrong, you will go to hell forever? You do not want that. Do you? No, but... If you were to take Jesus Christ as your own personal Savior then, you will be saved from hell because He loves you. So what you are saying is, if I worship and praise Him, I He will save me, and if I don't He will send me to hell forever. What? No. It's not like that. This sad argument is based on Pascal's wager. It is also very flawed. It assumes that there are exactly two options. Worship God, or don't. Well of course there are only two options, a positive and a negative. No. One option is to be a Christian. Another is to be an atheist, and another is to be a Muslim, or a Wiccan or Deist. There are a great many beliefs out there. Why would anyone be so foolish as to believe in one of those religions? Anyone who does will burn in hell, just like the atheists. Christianity is not the only faith to believe in a hell or a devil. Many faiths do. And hell is a punishment in most of them for worshipping another god. You, Matthew, could be sentenced to hell because your god was simply the wrong one. Impossible. My god is the only god. It says so in the Bible. The Quran says that Allah is the only god. The Bible is the first book ever written. The Bible was not a book when it was written. It was a bunch of different texts written by different people, and gathered together. And it was not the first text ever written, there were many before that, about many other gods. False gods. And there was only one Jesus Christ who died for our sins. Actually, Christ was one of a long line of prophets born of a virgin and eventually rose from the dead. Let's see there was Atis, Krishna, Mithra. Stop it. That is blasphemy. The fact is, there are many things that you don't know and many reasons why I have decided not to believe in anyone's mythology. But look at all the good God has done. I do not believe in a God. As for his people, exactly how many wars have been in the name of your God? How many lives have been lost? Human beings have been around for almost a million years on this planet, and within the last two thousand of those years we have been slaughtering each other in the name of gods. You dumb atheist. Get your facts straight. We have not been here for that long. The earth is only 4,000 years old. Wow, that is really, really sad. Well, have a good day Matthew. Wow.